John from More Bikes. We're at the Stretton Go Kart Circuit in Leicester. Great place for go karting, pit bike racing, paintballing. A while ago, we had one of our contributors review some hood motorcycle jeans. He compared them to a pair of Aldi jeans. Now, in a lot of the comments, we had people saying how good their Aldi jeans were because they only cost them 30 quid and they were nice and comfy. Now, to me, that isn't the best assessment of their performance in an accident. So, I went out and bought a pair of Aldi jeans and I've also got a pair of hood K7s here. These are 120 pound. What I want to do here is find out what the difference is between a premium pair of fully lined motorcycle jeans and a budget pair of part lined motorcycle jeans. And by part lined, I mean that the Aramid fibre here only covers certain areas. Now they're in a, a key impact point or your bum. Turn around to the front and the knees are covered. Now if we look at a pair of fully lined jeans, so here we can see both the, the back and the front are completely covered in this aramid fibre. Now this isn't science, this is a fun way of finding out whether you do actually need to buy a premium pair of fully lined motorcycle jeans or if you can just get away with something that costs you 30 quid. They're both made of 14 ounce denim on the outside and the Aramid inside the Aldi's actually looks pretty good. I'm going to tie them to the back of this twin engine cart that Stretton has lent us, drag them around, find out what happens. Now both pairs of jeans are packed with another pair of jeans and those jeans are filled with offcuts of Aramid. So they're the packing for these. Oh, a bit, about 20 kilos. So if I strap them to the back of the cart, they'll have some good weight behind them as they get slung around. Right, so both pairs of jeans have been tumbling along behind the go-kart here at Stren. Now, I had a GPS on me, uh, monitoring the speed. I got up to just over 55 mile an hour. Now, first impressions, both the jeans have got somewhere to them on the back. If we look at the hoods here, this is a premium pair of Aramid jeans. It's gone through the denim a little bit here, but the Aramid is completely fine, pockets torn off, that's it. If we look at this budget pair, this Aldi pair, there was no Aramid here, that would be your flesh. And on here, the Aramid pulled straight away from where it was sewn, the hole opened up, and the Aramid's torn. Again, all of that is your flesh. So if we flip them over, ah, first impression you'd think these have failed, but actually the armour here is on top of the Aramid fibre. So underneath, completely fine. At the top here we've got a hole that's actually nothing there. That's more denim for the pocket. It's worn through a little bit on the fly here, but again, there's Aramid protecting it. On this pair, if we flip them over. Okay, we've gone through the Aramid, but there's armor underneath. So again, we'd have been fine. Here though, there's nothing. This all would have been against your flesh. So here we've got a budget pair of jeans and a premium pair of motorcycle jeans. This pair, there's 90 pound difference between these. Certainly seeing the damage here and knowing that would have been my flesh, to me it's certainly worth paying that bit extra. <laughs> 